ya kwanza utadhibiti nyadhifa za wa wengi katika mabunge yote mawili ya kitaifa kutokana na idadi yake kubwa ya wabunge kiongozi wa taifa alisema ana ajenda mahsus ambayo anataka ifarikishwe na wandani wake katika mabunge hayo mawili wakati huo huo rais Ruto ametoa wito kwa upande wa upinzani pia kutekeleza ipasavyo majukumu yake bungeni our housing plan the plan that we were supposed to implement in 2018 but we lost the opportunity to implement it in 2018 because we took a tangent and went to BBI and went to other stories we i want to promise you that this is one plan that is a must do for us <clears throat> it will create millions of jobs for our young people it will sort out for us our challenge of housing many people are living in deplorable conditions in slums and other informal settlements they are paying 3 to 5000 shillings sometimes 6000 shillings in houses that have no toilet that have no water that have no electricity we can give those people a decent house where they will pay the same 5000 in terms of mortgage and we welcome our competitors um, assertion that they will take seriously their oversight role over our government we believe that the efficiency of any government is also dependent on how much we are kept on our toes so Uh, I want to tell our good friends on the other side of the political divide welcome to your oversight role we are ready to be accountable as a government the purposes of proper accountability of government we are going to work on the standing orders so that our CSS can come to parliament and you can ask them questions directly about your constituents